A pint of this milk would cost you about six euros. It's quite a thoroughbred beverage, coming not from cows, but from horses. And it's no mean feat getting hold of the stuff. These mares will only produce milk if their foals are nearby, and like any new mothers, they crave a peaceful environment. The owners of this organic farm in northwest France have learned to treat their charges with kid gloves. If there isn't a good relationship between the farmer and the horse, if the horse isn't comfortable, well, nothing's going to happen because in nature, a mare will only produce milk for her young. They have their own routines, and if you disrupt that, if you upset them even a little, the milk is the first thing to go. They just won't produce any. And even in the best conditions, mares only produce around five or seven litres of milk a day. That's a lot less than a dairy cow. But milk connoisseurs say it's all worth it, with the final product being lauded for its ease of digestion, its nutty taste, and above all, its therapeutic properties. Though it's still a rather fragile product. Mare's milk is very unstable substance, so if it's not treated quickly, it oxidizes and becomes undrinkable. Nature, of course, has its own reason for horses to produce milk. These new foals are adding to the 130 horses already on the farm. I still haven't really worked out why these animals, which really could be lethally dangerous, should be so gentle and look so kindly on man. For now, the price of their milk might stop you pouring it on your cornflakes, but Julie and Etienne now want to set up a small cooperative dairy, which they hope will help lower costs and make horses' milk affordable and attractive to a wider market.